Today was supposed to be a good day. Supposed to be. Uh, got to work on time. Had a good sleep last night. Uh, bright and refreshed. Wasn't tired at all when I got to work. Just as I was about to start work, I pretty much had my finger on the button for my computer. I get a phone call from my father. My grandmother passed away this morning. Now, it's the kind of phone call, to be honest, I've been expecting. Um, she was 90 years old and a diabetic. So she hung in there for a while, despite the diabetes. Like I said, I was expecting the phone call. Uh, I wasn't expecting it today. It's the kind of thing that's always in the back of your mind. But you don't bring it to the surface very often. Now, when I say today was meant to be a good day, uh, my son, will be awarded with the Student of the Month Award. Now it's just this little award that each student of each class, well not each student, but a student from each class at the primary school gets uh, for, for you know, good effort, good work. And uh, my son William, he has been trying to get this award since he was in grade one. He has been trying so hard to get the Student of the Month award for four years. He's in grade four now, halfway through grade four. So it says three and a half years. And today he's finally getting it. So yeah, today was supposed to be a good day. I've just said goodbye to my grandmother. Uh, spent a couple of hours at my parents' house. Uh, it was my, when I say grandmother, it was my mum's mum. Uh, my dad's parents died before I was born. So um, I've just left my parents' house, and I am currently en route to my son's school. That is the real reason why I packed the video camera today. Huh. So at least there is going to be some good news to come out of today. It's, it's going to do me very well to see how happy William is, to be honest. Because I, I, I've always felt very close to my grandparents. Later on in life, one of my biggest regrets was not seeing them enough. Now, I did see my grandmother just a few weeks ago. I tried to visit her as often as possible. I said to myself, once a month. You know, I think once a month is good because it is a pretty long drive from where I'm living out to my grandmother's you know, nursing home. And a lot, when you've got young kids, you can't just drive somewhere for an hour or two. You, you kind of have to make a day out of it. But now that my kids are older, it, it's nothing for us to just jump in the car and go. And th that is where we were at now. That, that's where we're at with my grandmother. Uh, we, we could just, all, all four of us, three of us, uh, we, we could just jump into the car and go. Unfortunately, not anymore. Now, because my son is getting the award for student of the month, my wife and I, separated wife now, uh, we have decided not to tell the kids today. We want, the, we want today to be a happy day for the kids. We're going to tell them on the weekend. Uh, my uh, 
wife and my brother and I, we have all decided that we're going to be present when we tell them because uh, they did love their nana. My, my grandmother, she, she didn't want to be called great grandma. She wanted my kids to call her nana. So they did. And now their nana is gone. And I'm not looking forward to it, but it's something that needs to be done. <sighs> so the next time you see some, the next part of this video you see, it's going to be at my son's school where he's receiving the Student of the Month award. He's going to be wearing such a big grin too because he's been trying so hard to get this award for three and a half years. See us then. Yeah, she went in a few minutes ago. There's the boy. I don't think he knows. Don't think he knows just yet. The one in the middle. <laughs> it's coming here. It's coming here, come on. What's that? Yep, so go sit down, mate, quickly. Grab a spot. recipients now. We have Angelina Lu from 4A for being focused and improving academic performance. From 4B, we, congratulations go to William Poole for being focused and improving academic performance. From 4D, we have Rihanna Aklatis for showing persistence to remain focused. Congratulations, Rayana. Angelica Quain has been using good manners this month. Congratulations, Angelica. And from 4S, we have Vincent Wu. Congratulations, Vincent. Yes. Three and a half. <laughs> Long enough. And Natalie Lin from 3J has been being focused and improving academic performance. Congratulations, Natalie. From 3K, we have Anthea Chen for showing persistence to remain focused. Selena Chu. Now we have our year twos, student of the month. First up we have Grace Kim. Congratulations Grace. Grace has been working cooperatively with others. I got a little chocolate cake. From 2F, congratulations go to Libby Noble for persisting and striving for improvement. And from 2L, Sarah Kirby has also been persisting and striving for improvement. To M, we have Mariah Atai for being res responsible and reliable. Congratulations, Brennan. <laughs> and 
boys and girls, let's give it a polite round of applause. He's just looking at it. Congratulations to all our students of the month. Mr. Mill will address the assembly. Thank you, Stephen. Good afternoon, boys and girls. Good afternoon, And a special welcome to uh, parents who are out to come along and celebrate their, uh, their special moment with their child, for those some of the students of the month. Also, uh, thank you to our staff. As um, Ms. Dallas said, we don't have chairs out today. The floor has dried, but they tell us.